Back when I was working, I kept myself busy 110% of the time. I would work 60 hours a week a lot of times. I'm usually out there earning, busting my butt, working all this overtime and working double time Sundays. You know, I didn't have any time to think about what I went through in Vietnam. After I quit work, all of a sudden all these memories came back. Flashbacks, nightmares of people that were just a casualty of the war, innocent people, you know, collateral damage. A lot of anger came out, depression, loneliness, guilt. And I was screaming and yelling all the time. Sometimes it got a little physical. And you know, I mean, I would never, ever hurt anybody in my family, but, but there were some close calls. I was about ready to end it all. And my wife just says, you need to get help. I was told to go through an evaluation and I was rated with PTSD. Being idle enhanced my symptoms. They were always there, but once it was brought out, they seemed to get worse and worse and snowball. I started getting treatment. I started going to the programs. I started going to group therapy. It was an older group, uh, mostly all Vietnam vets and all combat veterans. I mean, it was like looking in a mirror. And I couldn't honestly tell you that I probably would not be here right now if I didn't get the help from the PTSD treatment. I believe that PTSD treatment can work after 30, 40 years. I'm testimony through church and family and the treatment. I've got a better understanding and can get a hold of my PTSD. It's not an easy road. I'm not cured, but I'm here today.